day six. And today's message is kind of funny with how late I'm doing this video. And it's stop waiting for the feeling to do it. Just do it. Whatever it is, whether it's work, fitness, nutrition, um, conversation, homework, um, making a video, just do it. So especially in fitness, so many people just wait for that feeling. So uh, I, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna wait till I get the feeling to go work out. The feeling is never gonna come. You just have to do it. You have to do it, and then you get the feeling, and then it comes. It just doesn't happen where you're like, okay, now I'm gonna go work out. I can't wait to go work out. For a lot of people, that's not the case. So you just have to go do it. Stop waiting for it to happen. <clears throat> it's just like how people wait for the new year or wait for Monday, next week, next month, after this happens, when this stops. When th that happens, then I'll be good, then I can start. Why, nothing's gonna change. People keep thinking just because it turns Monday that they're gonna get this, this boost of motivation to start. And the truth is motivation, sometimes it just doesn't come. You need to create it yourself. And that's why I love the New Year's or, or messages that people will send me that, you know what, this challenge just isn't good, but you know what, next challenge I'm gonna try to get into. Okay, I mean, nothing's gonna change. It doesn't matter if you're busy now, you're gonna be busy then. You have to just do it. Just do it. I'm finally back in my gym routine. Do you know how many days I've actually wanted, like got that feeling to go work out out of the past seven days? Once. Once. And it was because it was leg day and I was feeling good. I had a good lunch. But that's, that's not even the point. Six out of the seven days, I didn't want to go to work out. I just wanted to eat shitty, watch a movie, do nothing. And that's what happens to a lot of people. They just wait for the feeling and then the moments pass. So stop waiting for the feeling. Go do it. Stop waiting for the momentum to come and create your own momentum. The feeling's not gonna come. You just have to do it. Stop waiting. Just stop waiting and go do it, especially with the gym. And it's just, people ask me, what's your motivation or how do you find motivation? Sometimes stop looking for motivation. Just create it. Stop looking for the thing that's gonna help you go and just do it. It's really that simple. Sometimes it's really just that simple. And I just love the message and it's just stop waiting for the feeling and just go create it. Go create it, especially with fitness and nutrition. Like nobody's gonna just want to just wake up one day and wanna eat a salad. Just eat a salad and then you're gonna be like, damn, I feel good, I ate the salad. But you're not gonna be like, well, I'd rather have a burger, obviously, but eat the salad, you're gonna feel good after. The feeling is never gonna come, and it's just so rare that it does eventually, like down the road, but getting started, how do you expect yourself to get in the mood to work out when you haven't been working out? Like you, you expect like some magic to happen, be like, okay, it's Monday, I actually wanna work out. I haven't worked out in like 10 years, but now I wanna work out. It doesn't work, especially eating. They're like eating, it's just people blow my mind when they're like, I just, I don't like this food. Well, yes, you don't like it because you never ate it. You're used to eating this sugar and this processed food, so how do you expect to go to eating this plain chicken or this broccoli or this light, lightly seasoned meat? Like, it doesn't just happen. You just have to do it. And it's, I used to hate broccoli, and I used to hate oatmeal. Then I started eating oatmeal, and I could only eat oatmeal with peanut butter and milk and just a ton of just add-ins. Now I can just eat oatmeal and water, and it's that simple. And it's just, just do it. And it's so, like I said, things are so simple, but it's just stop waiting for the feeling to come. Stop waiting for that feeling and go out and do it. Day six, guys. And it's probably, it's probably my favorite message yet because it can relate to everything. And it's just, it's a beautiful thing. Stop waiting for the feeling.